Hey, good morning. This is Bob Miller. Bob Miller Success with day 260 of 365 days. Where I've, this year, where I'm naming at least one person every single day who I'm grateful for. Now, today, I'm going to apologize in advance. There is a, a new friend that I just had, a friend of Rita Barnes, who sent me a friend request and, and responded to a post that I put down last night about Wayne Dyer. And she said she's a big Wayne Dyer fan, been following him for a lot of years, and she, she likes you know, some of the things that I'm doing. So her name is Mary, and I yeah, I write this, this card down, all the little things I want to say and the people I want to name. And I forgot to write her name, but it's Mary. I, I will put, I will edit her name inside of the video. So Mary, you know you know what this is about. You're a friend, friend of, of Rita, or Rena, Rena Barnes. But anyways, I want to talk about Wayne Dyer. Last night, and well, there's some other people I'm going to mention too that I'm grateful for, and I'll mention them at the end. This way, here you get this way. Make sure you're going to watch the video. But anyway, so last night I was I watched another a, a program of Wayne Dyer's that he did back in 2011 here in San Diego. Actually, it was up in Escondido, California, where it was uh, it was a PBS program, wishes full wishes fulfilled, and and I watched it. I watched it when it came, first came out, and then last night I watched it again last night, and it was like. It was like so much different than it was the first time. It's like I've, I'm a different person than I was four years ago, and it's amazing. So, I'm, in that in that program, he met, he mentioned he was talking about how we change, our bodies change, everything, nothing stays the same. Every, everything that we do changes. We're not we're no longer the little body that we were when when we were young and we grow up, and so every everything changes in, in life. So. I changed. I changed over the last four years. So what I decided to do, I'm going. I am starting now. I am going to start posting more, writing in my blog, and I'm going to put most of the things on my page of Bob Miller Success and Facebook page Bob Miller Success. This way, I won't get lost with all the other thousands of posts and things like that. But I'm. I'm going to start. I'm going to. I am doing. Studying Wayne Dyer, and he mentioned last night about, about the the Tao, the Tao Te Ching, and he said the Tao Te Ching is. You can read it in a, in a day. It's just 81 verses of the Tao Te Ching that, written by Lao Tzu. So you can read it in a day, but you can study it for a lifetime. Now, if you, if you want a shortcut to wisdom, and that's what I would look at Wayne Dyer is a shortcut to wisdom, because this man has written like 45 books, and, and he's studied so much. He, he's, he's so wise. The guy was so wise. And now the fact that he just passed away about a month ago, it's like it, it's, it's showing me my own vulnerability. So I am going to do it the best I can do to give a shortcut to wisdom to tap into his vast wisdom and I'm going to share it. I'm going to share it on my blog, I'm going to share it on, on my Facebook page, and I'm going to share it on Bob Miller Success on my Facebook page. So anyway, so that's, that's what I, I just want to give you a heads up that I'm going to be doing a lot more about Wayne Dyer. I could probably talk about him for, for the rest of my life. So here's the other people that I'm grateful for. My son Mike, who's coming here this weekend, I think he's here like right now. He's gonna be here for a few days to see his his new uh, his new niece Molly, and then of course he'll be here for the for my granddaughter Kaylee's birthday party. Uh, he's five years old, so we're having a birthday party for on, on Sunday. Then Len Mooney, I'll be seeing him again probably today because he's gonna be here. He's going on a, a ski trip. He, you know, he's he's only seven years old, so he needs to go water skiing before he has his his hip operation, you know, right? Like you need that lens, sure you do. And then, and then Susan Sherry Young, Susan Sherry Young, as I was reading Wayne Dyer this morning, I, I was reading another one of his books, Change Your Thoughts, Change Change Your Thoughts, Change Your Life. And, 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 and he's talking about allow, allowing, how to allow. Now, when I read that book years ago, I didn't, never heard of Susan Sherry Young, but Susan Sherry Young talks about how, to, the book she wrote was called How to Allow how to allow so it's everything that I've done before it's different now everything is changing it's just changed so new things have come into my life so I recommend you go ahead and, and check her out go check out Susan Sherry Young read her book how to allow okay so those are the people today Rena Barnes her friend Mary my son Mike Len Mooney Susan Sherry Young Wayne Dyer so I'll see you tomorrow on day 261 in the meantime who are you grateful for? And then you know, go to my go to my blog, go to my YouTube channel, and leave a comment, and just you know say, hey, I, I think this is pretty cool. I like Wayne Dyer too. Get involved in a conversation about Wayne Dyer. Okay, so I'll talk to you tomorrow. You know, so who are you grateful for? I'll see you then. Bye bye.